Well, hello everyone, it's me, Christine, again. Welcome, today I play with my face. I came across these videos on Instagram and was instantly intrigued and turned on. <laughs> what is this magical color shifting witchcraft? Is this a disease and where do I catch it? Have we finally made contact with aliens? It is, my friends, multi-chrome makeup. <laughs> And by now I've seen more than one indie makeup company come out with something like this, but I'll be honest, it was that full hand video that really got me going. <laughs> if you live in the nail polish obsessed world like I do, then you may already know what multi-chrome is. But for those that don't, let me explain. It is very complicated and technical, but I will try my best. <laughs> a multi-chrome finish involves a pigment that shifts primarily between two or three predominant colors depending on the angle of the light. You may think it's magic, but it's science somehow. <laughs> I still can't explain it, but it is. You may also have heard objects that look like this referred to as duochrome, and in the car industry, they call it chameleon paint. I personally think it's all pretty much the same shit, or at least the base powder is the same, <laughs> but different industries will add different mixing mediums or additives to serve whatever purpose they have or to create a different type of application. And one other very important thing to note, multi-chrome is not Hollow. <laughs> Hollow, on the other hand, is the true love of my life. <laughs> Hollow, on the other hand, is also made of some kind of metal pigment, but it shows the full spectrum of the rainbow, and that rainbow travels with the light, instead of just shifting to one color depending on the angle of the light, scientifically speaking. <laughs> In any case, the first thing that came into my head when I saw the powdery multi-chrome makeup was how much it looked like multi-chrome nail powder. <laughs> So, is this makeup nail powder? <laughs> this sounds like a case for simply nail-logical. Could someone please call her? Anyone? Does anyone know where she is? Haven't seen her in years. <laughs> in the jar, it looks almost identical, both in color and powderiness. But when I buffed it on the nail, it was definitely more dull than the real nail powder. It wasn't as reflective, and it almost has kind of a cloudy finish to it. So this tells me that there's some kind of difference between the two. I guess this is supposed to be reassuring. <laughs> so then I reached out to my nail powder dealer, got an ingredient list from her so I could compare it to the list of ingredients from the makeup company. <laughs> I mean, it is almost back to school season, so I had to do my homework. Looking at the difference in the ingredient lists, it's clear to me that there's a lot more shit in the makeup one. <laughs> Some of those might be additives that are more commonly used in makeup to help it go on the skin smoother. But the common denominator looks like aluminum and iron. Maybe some magnesium of some sort. Hello, are there any scientists out there? Please comment down below. We would like your peer review, thank you. <laughs> so even though it looks like the multi-chrome face makeup is not just repackaged nail powder, <laughs> I'm still a little bit skeptical about these special effects types makeup for your face. There's a big fake hollow problem going on right now in the beauty industry and no one is talking about it. <laughs> and there has been some real hollow makeup, but I haven't seen any larger cosmetics companies coming out with it, which makes me still question whether or not I should put this stuff on my face. And that's exactly why I bought 12 of these multi-chrome makeup powders. <laughs> but because my face actually hates me, I knew I had to do some testing before I did what I'm going to do today. <laughs> I first tested it on my arms, then my face, and detected no allergic reaction. And then I even put it on one of my eyes just to, you know, get a pirate look if I did have an allergic reaction. I kept the makeup on for a few hours and didn't have a reaction when I took it off. Some of you guys who have been with me for over a year now, thank you for staying. Know that I had to take a bit of a break from Simply Face Logical last year because I had a bit of a reaction and I wasn't entirely sure what was causing it. I have now figured it out and I'm allergic to different types of metals that can be used in makeup. Now those metals are not listed in the ingredient list for these guys, so technically I should be fine. It's also been a while since I've had that really bad allergic reaction like I used to get, maybe almost a year now. So I figure my skin's fine now, let's f it up. <laughs> now in doing all this, I had to figure out what the best way was to actually apply this on the skin. I tested a few different methods. <laughs> 
after testing all these methods of application, we're gonna go in with the Fix Plus. Like a true booty guru. First things first, I need to make my hand look like that hand. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. Keep your clothes on. <laughs> I'm just gonna wipe my hand free of oils or cat hair. Menche, stop licking your bed! Is it just me or did everything just get a lot brighter in the shot? Cause I'm so pasty white. <laughs> I'm so white I throw the white balance off. <laughs> oh my god. <gasps> I need more. Oh my god, what if I put it over my nails? Ah! <laughs> Menchie, I just turned your design multi-chrome. I'm just gonna paint the inner corners of my fingers. <laughs> Cause you don't want to give away that you're human. The more you buff it into the skin, the more reflective it's getting. So it really does behave like the nail powders in that sense. Where do I stop? Or should I stop? <laughs> wow. My hand looks like an alien witch predator. <laughs> Give this video a high five. Everything I touch turns to multichrome. Menchi, Menchi, you better be careful. <laughs> so right now under the beauty lights, you're mostly just seeing the predominant color of this shade, which is purple. But if you can see in my other camera, the very far end of this color shade spectrum, which is an indigo blue, and then you can kind of see it shift to the other end of its spectrum, which is a yellow. That, look at, look at that shift. Oh my God, will you marry me? <laughs> look at how it covered up my nails but yet it still maintained the little kitty heads. Now I'm pretty sure I don't have enough of just one multi-chrome shade to put on my entire face. So I'm gonna do a blend of a couple of my favorites. All right, I'm ready. Just gotta clean off my brush first. <laughs> I'm scared, but mostly excited. <laughs> okay, here we go. There's no turning back. I believe in miracles. Where you from? Sex -a -thing, sex -a -thing, yeah. <laughs> this is amazing. Oh my god, guys, La Mer came out with a new product. It literally makes you look like La Mer, which is the C in French, in case the booty gurus didn't know that. And don't forget to bring it down all the way to your neck. You gotta make your neck match your face, it's very important. You got a pimple? Cover it up with multichrome, it'll bring it out even more. <laughs> Hey, honey. <laughs> How you like me now? Is this some weird cosplay shit? I'm morphing. <laughs> Into what? High five? That's not too bad. <laughs> How far down your body are you gonna go? All the way, baby. <laughs> yeah, keep going. We can put this on Twitch. <laughs> what? Why Twitch? Because there's lots of girls that just stream on Twitch. They, they multi-chrome? Thank you for the tea, bae! Now, I don't think you're supposed to put this on your lips because you're not supposed to ingest it, but I just won't lick my lips. <laughs> Look, you can even see the purple shift on my chin. Oh my god, I have such an angled chin, I did not know that! <laughs> now, around the actual eye area, I'm gonna go in with a much smaller eye brush thing so I can make sure that I'm not putting it in my eyeball. Cause I would like vision after this video. <laughs> now let's shift into a different shade. <sighs> this is so f***ing crazy. <laughs> in this camera it looks pink, but in this camera it looks gold and yellow. And you can see all my wrinkles. <laughs> see, if I got Botox, then you wouldn't see any of this dimension. <laughs> I wonder if we can like blend these shades like a true artiste. Let's see. <gasps> wow! <laughs> Yo, I'm a fucking artist! I'm still rather uh, shocked how easy this is to just wipe on your face like this and it's done and it looks great. Is this dangerous if it's this easy to look this good? Should we be worried about the children? Or just what the children watch on YouTube? Hi parents, I'm sorry. <laughs> Gotta do the eye carefully again so I'm just keeping it closed. Oh, wow, this is so beautiful. <laughs> I feel like every Monday when I go into the office and coworkers ask, what did you do this weekend? I always lie and I'm like, you know, not much. 
Now we gotta blend, bitch. I think I'm gonna have to throw the shirt out after. <laughs> All right, what do you say we do a third color? Oh, oh my God. Wow, that one's even crazier than the others. <laughs> my face is like one of those when you leave Sephora memes. <laughs> I went to the doctor and he said, I'm so sorry to tell you, but you have the mutation gene. I guess I did it. Full face and multi-chrome challenge. Nope, it's not a challenge. Please don't do this. Just watch me do it. <laughs> Hi, my name's Christine and I'm a 29 year old multi-chrome. What species are you? Ban? Ban. Ban. What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? <laughs> I think Menchie's scared. Menchie! Who is that? Boo! I need your assistance, Ben. We're gonna have a little light show. I'm ready for the mandatory narcissistic montage. Just another day on my channel. Who would ever use that? What would you use Me, this bitch! For? Don't f with Simply. You never know when I'll turn on you. <laughs> I feel like my body is slowly turning into a nail polish. <laughs> oh my god. It's saying something. What's that? You say Zyler comes down at night and knocks you off the shelves? <laughs> um, is it picture day yet? Cause you... You love it how I look, you, you love it how I shift, you the one. Tweet me on the phone, cause you believe God is a multi <laughs> I have such a bad voice. <laughs> That's so bad. Bad! <laughs> you will see me in your nightmares. <laughs> I gotta take this off now. Playtime is over. <laughs> I need your help to shower. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I can't touch anything. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody. Thanks so much for swatching. <laughs> and I'll see y'all later. Bye!